Good morning guys and welcome back to the channel. So this video will be pretty short but uh, I hope could help uh, others if uh, you will have the same problem that I had. As you remember we have here the combs. And well after fixing it, putting the battery, we run it, but it suddenly stopped working. And every time I turn on the car, I had the same message, the 4504S, it says the battery is not connected. I had no idea why that would happen and I did different tests. And uh, I was sure to measure the uh, voltage on the battery and the battery was uh, correctly 80 plus volt. But when I was going to measure through the BMS, so the positive lead and the P minus on the uh, BMS, I got only 4 volt, 4 point. Uh, that means uh, the BMS stopped uh, working. It uh, cut out the uh, battery, avoiding uh, additional low voltage to, to discharge, so to protect the battery itself. But this wasn't the situation because uh, again the battery was working. So why, 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 why? And uh, I was even considering, okay, I will bypass the BMS because uh, the BMS, uh, honestly, it worked on the charging side, but not on the discharging side. So I searched a lot and I found how to reactivate the BMS because. Uh, even if I have uh, this, as you remember, we push and uh, we wake up the uh, BMS, it didn't work. So what you have to do is to short the P minus with a B minus. That simply wake up the uh, BMS and you're ready to use it again. So now, if I turn on my car, no problem. We still not have any memory, uh, but that's uh, another problem on the comps and uh, I don't care because I can measure the voltage of the battery through the battery capacity voltage, uh, things that uh, we have installed before. So I spent uh, two days try to understand uh, why and finally I got it so we can go back and run with the car and before closing just uh, an additional update that I have done because I was here um, I have uh, uh, changed the uh, charging port for the uh, two uh, LiFePO4 battery and I have installed uh, this kind of frame to keep them so it would be just a little bit more clean. And also instead of the uh, boot that I used before as a, a spacer uh, to lift up the uh, floor of the car, I have installed this metal uh, part uh, that are sturdier and uh, I feel like a little bit more comfortable with this. That's all for me for today. Thank you for watching, hope it helped. Someone that has the same uh, issue with a BMS that doesn't wake up. Uh, and uh, as usual, guys, see you next time. Bye.